Yeah, in this example, we're going to be modeling a town's population that has been growing linearly. Um, in the year 2003, the population is 58,000, and the population has been growing by 2,200 people per year. And what they've told us as far as our variables go, our P is going to represent our population, and X is the years after the year 2003. So I'm going to go ahead and set it up as P of X. And to model this, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and say it's the initial population in the year 2003 plus the rate of change multiplied by the number of years since 2003. Okay, so our initial population in this case, we said we had 58,000 people in the year 2003, plus the rate of change, it's increasing by 2,200 people, multiplied by the number of years since 2003. Well, they tell us that X represents the number of years since 2003. So it's gonna be 58,000 plus 2,200 times X. Now, if the population should have been decreasing um, year after year after year, that'd be a negative 2,200. But in this case, it's positive because it's increasing. All right, hope this helps as you're trying to set these up. Good luck.